YouTube. So today I'll be just showing you guys my favorite extensions for Google Chrome. So this is dated on October 30, 2013. So coming in at number one, obviously be ad block. You guys all probably know about it. Basically, it blocks ads. So throughout my lifetime of using this, I've actually blocked 92,046 ads in total. And this will pretty much allow you to not see ads. Some web pages now actually do not run slash execute if you have, they detect that you're using ad block. But you can temporarily pause ad block on a page. Uh, this one's a panic button. So essentially, see, I have like another tab open to like DW News. And then someone comes and they want to hide. Click You click on the panic button. And then it quickly closes everything. It loads up. It's going like that. Let's see, I go to like... Google and then I want to restore my previous pages I click on that and it sends me back to the news uh, continuing on next it would probably be the dictionary now this isn't actually my favorite part of the dictionary but my favorite part of the dictionary is actually just double clicking on any word and it tells you the definition of it so let's say I don't know what hypocrisy means double click on it and then it directly gives you the definition. You can just copy and paste or whatever you need. And then it also says through audio and the computer what hypocrisy means. So I just find that to be very neat. Uh, coming up next would be the calculator. Calculator is just add on. This is a simple calculator, but it's really fast and easy to use since it's already in my extensions bar. And next would be just Wolfram Alpha. So in case you guys have been, haven't seen the Wolfram Alpha videos on my channel, Wolfram Alpha is a computational engine. It allows you to do numerous, like even math or just anything in general. So here I input it in Wolfram Alpha, and it can calculate 4 plus 5. And it just shows you a bunch of graphs. You can do like demographics of Germany with Wolfram Alpha. And here it will show you the demographics of Germany. So negative growth rate, show rates, show distribution. And then it will show you all the demographics, all the distributions, male, children, elderly, etc. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you want more of these types of videos, please like and subscribe. Thank you.